This is going to be a real quick follow-up video to my pond area or pump build. And I don't know how long it's been, maybe about a year. It has been running the entire time. I haven't had any problems with it. Still running. My little uh, fan is still cranking, helping the, the unit stay cool. It's very cool to the touch. Um, no, real, uh, no real problems with it. Um, the only thing, I don't remember what kind of weed this is. Uh, the pond previously had a lot of these weeds. And I don't suppose that aeration helps with that. Every now and then I come through with some, uh, a little bit of Roundup and uh, put on it. And it helps kind of knock it down. But the algae level, the algae bloom level is really decreased. And you can see the two aerator sites. Uh, but still quite a, quite a lot of weeds and I just have to come through with Roundup and it'll take care of that. So this is kind of a one year update on the pond aerator build. Uh, if you're looking to get rid of these weeds, an aeration is not going to do it for you. But if you're looking to get rid of moss, I mean really, that's about the most moss that I have in the pond now. And that's probably there simply because the, the weeds are kind of blocking some of the uh, natural flow of the aerations. One thing I did want to mention about the pond uh, with the aerators running is uh, it is still a little bit murky. You can see down in there a little ways, maybe a couple inches. Um, so it is still murky. But if you see that right there, that's cow turd. And my cows come down this trail here. And you can see all through here that where they where they stop and drink from the water. And that, that gets the pond stirred up pretty good. So given that this is a stock tank for my cows, this is always going to be murky. So just wanted to mention that. If you're looking for uh, aeration to clarify the water, it should help. But in my case, it's not going to do a whole lot simply because of the cows utilizing it.